you, boys. Dad? I screwed up with you a lot, didn't I? Hmm. No, that's okay. No, it's not. Sammy, tell me the truth. I don't want to talk about that. You didn't have a problem talking about it before you left. This is the night you ditched us for Stanford, isn't it? Last time we were together, we had one hell of a fight. Yes, sir. This is where I left in the first place. What'd you say? You heard me. Yeah, you left. Your brother and me, we needed you. You walked away, Sam. You walked away. Stop it, both. You're the one who said, don't come back, Dad. You're the one who closed that door, not me. This is a happy memory for you? I don't know. I, mean, I was on my own. I finally got away from Dad. Can we not fight? You know, half the time we're fighting, I, I don't know what we're fighting about. We're just button heads. For me, that fight, I don't even remember what I said. I, I mean, yeah. And what? You did some messed up things. Dad's gonna be here, right? It's Christmas. When I told Dad I was scared of the thing in my closet, he gave me a 45. Well, what was he supposed to do? I was nine years old. Dad never showed, did he? Dad lied to me. I mean, when I think about you, and I think about you a lot, I don't think about our, our fights. I think about you. I think about you on the floor of that hospital. I'm sorry that the last time I was with him, I tried to pick a fight. Sorry that I spent most of my life angry at him. And for all I know, he died thinking that I hate him. I think about how I never got sick. I am so sorry. This is never the life that I wanted for you. You know, when Dean came to get me at school, I swore I was done hunting for good. I told myself, one last job, and this is over. I'm done. I mean that. You know, one more job. Dean, the year that I took off, I had something I've never had. A normal life. I guess I really understand now that... So, you saved the world. We're the guys who saved the world. This is my life. More than once. After your mother passed. All I saw was evil. I wanted you prepared, ready. So somewhere along the line, I, uh, I stopped being your father. I became your, your drill sergeant. I'm sorry, too. But you did your best. That you, you fought for us. I love you both so much. That's enough. It doesn't feel fair to get all this and have to throw it away. And I know we have to. Then let me go. I am so proud of you boys.